has been a long time coming. I don't remember the last time that I decluttered my makeup stash. It's atrocious. So I've been doing a lot of organizing when it comes to my skincare products and the makeup products. And we're gonna go based on what the industry standards are for getting rid of this stuff. Many times the expiration dates are actually on the package. Like when it's opened, it'll say you throw it away within six months, 12 months, 24 months, whatever the case is. If you love a good declutter video, then this is a video for you. Okay, I am already cringing at this closet right now. It has so many things in it. Clearly candles up top, just stuff. This is a Cosmo cube that I got back when Cosmo cubes were the thing. It's got a lot of stuff in it, extra candles and just things. This is an, a moisture absorber pack. You may have seen this in my vlog and it's perfect to absorb, like I just said, moisture because come on, like stuff gets mildewy and disgusting. Here in the Cosmo cube, a bunch of stuff that just needs to go. And I know that because I've barely come in here and I just know. So let's go through this. So this Fashion Fair lipstick, for instance, I used what, what, one time? This is a beautiful color. I just don't do dark lips. Maybe I should do dark lips again. This is the shade Rebel. If you wanna see a dark lip video, let me know. I don't wear them often. It's still a good product, so I am gonna keep that. Like, look at this right here. Kevin Aquan lipstick, perfectly brand new. Clearly gonna keep this one still. And this is the shade Enigma. This Tom Ford lip gloss is gonna stay. This is new from this year when I went to LA. This is what? Per, 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 per what? Perepera? Oh my God, Perpera? My goodness gracious. Is that the name of the company? Perpera? It looks like the printer ink. Interesting. Yeah, I have worn this. It looks like I've worn it. I just can't recall. It, it is not expired, because this is new from this year. I guess I'll keep it and maybe wear it. I don't know, we'll see. This is a Pat McGrath lip gloss. I did wear this one time. It did separate strangely, because, but that's because it's laying down. So this one is still new, still good. These are two Huda lip stains. I like these. I like the finish of them. I just don't like the actual shades. You're not gonna see me wear too many colors like this. It makes me feel matronly. You might love it. It makes me feel matronly. This is the shade Icon. This light pink one right here is perfectionist. I like them. I just know that I'm not going to wear the Icon one. So this is gonna go, but I will keep this one. I'll try to wear it. This is a Tom Ford lipsticks called Twist of Fate. This is new. I got this this year when Tom Ford invited me out to LA. Use this what, once or twice? It's a pretty color. I definitely wanna make sure I get some more wear out of this one. Got some assorted lippies right here. First of all, you know I do my ombre, so the brown is because I ombre it. This is Sushi Kiss from MAC. Yo, this is an OG. I've had this for a while because I remember getting this when I did Back to MAC. This has to be from over a year ago. This is so agonizing to me, giving away stuff that's still good. But the thing is, do I want to get a lip Perpy, a lip cold sore, you know, as a result of me trying to hold on to something that I consider to be good. No, I don't want that. So ugh, I'm gonna keep the MAC stuff and then do another back to MAC, but this has to go. This lip powder from Koki Cosmetics, I wore once or twice, this is old. I used to love wearing bright pink lips like this, but it's been a while since I've done so. These are borderline about to expire, so I'm gonna get rid of these. Oh my gosh, who remembers Lime Crime? I remember they had a popular yellow lipstick that I wanted so badly. <laughs> I almost said, is this this it? No, this is not the one. This is a nice hot pink lipstick. I know I've had this for a while because I don't even remember when I got this. So this is old, this has to go. Oh, this is a good one. This is pretty new. This is called I Vote For Me. It's a liquid lip color from MAC. It's a really pretty color, beautiful for the fall. Maybe I'll get some use out of it. Let's see. I'm gonna put this close to the Rebel Fashion Fair color since the two of them are a deep, deep plum brown type color. This color is pretty. Giorgio Armani Lip Maestro 205. Definitely did not get enough use out of this one. Beautiful for the fall. It's like a burnt red color. I can see myself wearing this. So I'm gonna hang on to it. Here's another Huda Beauty liquid matte lipstick. This color is pretty. It's a muted violet type of pink color. It's not my judge. I used to really be into this kind of colors when I was working in the office. I used to wear a different lip color every single day and I would have totally rocked this one even as an ombre. I just don't wear colors like this anymore. So this one has to go. I actually really enjoyed this lip gloss. I wore this in a YouTube video. This is a black owned brand that was sent to me. Bronze Diamonds Luscious Lips. The shade is Summer Peach. This is beautiful. Although I've definitely had this for a year. So it's gotta be expired. Oh my gosh, the Dose of Colors and Nima Tang collaboration from what, last year? This was really pretty. It's a gloss, right? It goes in and out like a mascara. It spoils really easily. Again, I don't wanna get cold sores, so this one has to go, but barely used. I actually don't think I ever used this. Did I ever use it? Oh my God, I think I never, hold on. I think I never used this. It doesn't look used at all. Hang on, okay. I've never used it, although it is open, so air did get into it, but it's not been used. What? I need to make sure I use this. I'm gonna keep this.
This I did use Girl Lactic Glow Gloss. This was really pretty, or still is really pretty. Again, lip gloss expired, gotta go. This one is still a good MAC liquid lip color. This is the shade Feel Me and such a pretty nude. Creamy matte, just delicious. This one still has some weird time with it, so I'm gonna keep it. Why did Fenty discontinue pumpkin? Did they discontinue pumpkin rose? Yeah, this is the one that's discontinued. Now, I do have a new video that you can find on my channel. It is recent, where I put on a Sephora collection orange lipstick that looks just like this, but this, I believe, is discontinued. The problem is when I wanna wear something that is discontinued, it's an issue for you all when you're like, what lippy is that? Oh my God, and this is old. Used a few times, and now I gotta get rid of it because this is old. This is old a year old oh. and while I'm cleaning this stuff out and I'm in such agony please let me know when the last time is or was that you cleaned out your stash or are you cleaning yours out right now with me I want to know I cannot be the only one in agony these lipsticks are new I did a few activations with Sephora and give beauty so I know that these are new original recipe and Laura both reddish type lipsticks we have another plum lipstick. This is called Blood Moon from Lime Crime. This is new, kind of. Wait, hold on. <laughs> I wore this in a video too. How long has it been? Oh my God, it's been a long time. Just kidding, gotta go, trash. This one from Koki also gotta go. It's really, really bright and you gotta be really careful when you blend this in ombre style. And it's old, so this one has to go as well. Makeup by Mario, oh my goodness. This is definitely, all of my Makeup by Mario stuff is definitely a year old. This is a beautiful color. It's called Alicia, so gorgeous. What did I wear this one time? Nauseating again. But this is old, right? How long ago did Makeup by Mario come out when it first, first came out? This is where this lipstick is from. It's gotta be approaching a year. Oh my God, oh, I think I should stop. This is making me so sick because I'm approaching some really good ones. Here's Give Beauty again. This is what, a gloss? Hold on. This is Original Recipe, I'm Still Here. Uh, it's a lip stain. I need to wear some red this year, come on. Comment, let me know if you wanna see again a red lippy type tutorial situation. I don't wear red very often. I gotta use some of these, goodness gracious. Oh my gosh, KBD Vegan Beauty. Did I ever wear this? Uh, maybe one time. Let's check her out. Yep, I wore this. Looks really pretty. Ugh, I think I still have some more weird time with this. Let's hang on to this one. Yo, how many red lipsticks does a woman need? Like, give me a break. This is YSL. Girl, Yves Saint Laurent, like, come on. This is number 21. Like, do you just throw away a YSL lipstick? Come on. I wore this one time. Some of the stuff you just want to keep because, but yo, like, what are we doing with old stuff? This is not not yet a year. This is not yet a year. I am gonna hang on to it. I have to give this some use. We're gonna put this to use. Oh my gosh. These I definitely got, if not earlier this year, last year, not quite a year yet, but I remember getting a huge PR box from Maybelline with these Superstay Matte Lip Inks. This one is a gorgeous color, number 20 Pioneer. This one is really, really beautiful on my skin too. Did lots of videos where I wore this. I still have some more wear time with this one. This is a pretty Charlotte Tilbury lipstick. It's called Red Wishes. I wore this one once or twice. This is not old. Mm, I I think I got this earlier this year, so I'm gonna hang on to this. Oh my gosh, we haven't even made much of a dent. Ooh, we gonna be here all day, I can't do it. Rare Beauty Lip Conditioner. I don't think I've ever worn this. Gonna keep this and make sure I get some use out of it. Oh my gosh, those of colors and Nima Tang. It has separated, can you see? I don't think I ever wore this. This is definitely a year old. The color Zoe, this is old. Oh my gosh, it looks so pretty. Oh my God, and then the accompanying lipstick too. I wore this once or twice, it's old, gotta go. Wow, Juvia's Place Afrique Matte Lipstick. This is old. This one has to go. Oh my goodness, Giorgio Romani Lip Power 403. This is another red. I'm sure I wore this once or twice. Oh my God, how long has it been? I have no idea. <sighs> I think this one has to go. This is a pretty sheer red lipstick from Yves Saint Laurent. This is the number 131. Again, it's sheer. I wore this in an activation with them with the Sephora squad. This is pretty if you want a sheer application of red lipstick. It really is beautiful. Yeah, this is not a year old. This one I can still keep. All right, wow. Top drawer is done. Made a little bit of a dent, but we are nowhere close. Okay, let's look at concealers. Oh my God. Okay. Oh my gosh. I literally forgot about this concealer. Makeup Forever Matte Velvet Skin. This is not yet a year old, but definitely approaching a year. Need to make sure I use this. This is old, okay? Maybelline Fit Me? Wow. This is old. Just hands down. I like it. It's wicked old. This is the shade 50 Cafe. Mm -mm, gotta go. This is giving me very much eye sty. <laughs> Oh my goodness, Too Faced Born This Way. Multi-use sculpting concealer in the shade Maple. When did I get this? This is old too. I have not used this in a minute. It has to be over a year. I am sick because this is not done. This is not done. There's a lot left in here. Oh 
Come on. I'm so annoyed. This is not fun. Yo, when you gotta try different products and then you open a lot of different things, it's just painful to me. I think this one has to go. Oh my God, I'm sick. This has to go. Oh my goodness. I purchased so many of these Morphe concealers, full coverage, freaking love this so, so much. This particular one has to go, very old. Wow, and it has been a minute since I've used Juvia's Place products. This number 12 concealer, love, it has to go. This is old. And it's not really done, but it's old. It's really old. It's gotta go. So many more and we've barely scratched the surface. Oh my God. How many concealers do I have? Like 50? Who knows? I remember this Beauty Blender concealer. I did a video with this and I liked it. The whipped one. This is not yet a year, but it is inching close. This one I can still keep. Definitely forgot I even have this. LYS Triple Fix Full Coverage Brightening Concealer. What? Again, just so many things just completely forgot. I used this in a video. I did like it. I'm gonna keep it. We still got some weird time on this. Benefit Cosmetics Boing Concealer. This one was good. The color is really light, but you know, I can make this work somehow. Not quite yet expired. Gonna still keep this, but it's getting on its way. Oh my God, Fenty Concealer 430. This one is getting on its way too. I can still get some wear out of this. I need to get with it, okay? This is gonna expire very soon. This It Cosmetics Concealer is definitely old. I do not remember the last time that I used this, so this is definitely gonna go in the trash. Two other good options, definitely old. This other Benefit Boing Concealer and then Maybelline Fit. Anything Maybelline Fit Me is old. I have not purchased anything Maybelline Fit Me in a very long time, so this is gonna go in the trash. Jaclyn Hill Concealers. These are fairly new. I still have some more time to get through these. This e.l.f. Cosmetics Hydrating Camel Concealer still have some more time as well. They don't have the expiration date on them, but they're definitely nearing, it's nearing its expiration date for sure, but I still have some more time to use this. And here's an e.l.f. Camel Matte, got some time. This is obviously in the wrong place. This is Juvia's Place Eye Prep Eye Primer, Wicked Old, going in the trash. The Makeup Forever HD Concealer is new. I'm gonna keep this one. This Huda Faux Filter Concealer is new as well. This shade is Chocolate Chip, is it Chocolate Chip? Yep, Chocolate Chip. This one is new, I'm gonna keep these too. This can be used as a contour and this one can be used to conceal blemishes on the face because of the shades. Too Faced Born This Way Ethereal Light Concealer is new. This Kosas one, oh man, it is definitely nearing its expiration date because it's been a minute. Almost gotta go. I can still use this one. I definitely did a video last year where I used this Revlon concealer. I haven't touched it since. I don't know if I loved it that much, but it's totally been a year. So this is gonna go. This Superstay shade wasn't the most amazing. It's maybe been a year. I'm gonna just get rid of these two to be safe. Sephora Best Skin Ever. This shade is good for the brow. Gonna keep this. This is obviously new. So good, did a whole video on this. Make sure you watch it. I'll link it below. LA Girl Pro Conceal. I have not purchased this in ages. This is wicked old. This is the shade Fawn, right? Oh my gosh, I used to use this every single day. It is still so good. I'm going to repurchase because this is a tried and true, amazing, very affordable concealer. Do you still use this? Comment and let me know. I used this all the time on clients when I was a makeup artist. This is just so good and so cheap. So good. These are new. NARS Soft Matte Complete Concealers. Two different colors, Amand and Cacao. This MAC Paint Pot in the shade Painterly is wicked old. Like I still use the, I'm, no, I'm going to get rid of it. It's old. Like, come on. It's giving eye style. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to get rid of this. I'm going to add this to my back to MAC stash. If I have five, I can get a free lipstick. So I'll put this in that stash. I am so annoyed because I bought these with the intention of doing a video and I never did the video. I've never used these. NYX Vivid Brights Cream Colors. Literally the wrapper is still on it, but look, it's broken on the inside. I think I can still use this. It's not been opened. I'm gonna use it, but the question is, is it even still available for purchase? I never use these, I'm gonna keep these. I know I'm gonna have to throw away so many of these lippies that I'm sick about it because I love, I love these shades, but they're old. I'm annoyed by that. I'm not gonna lie. I love these Maybelline Superstays. I feel like they're within the year. I'm gonna give it at least until the end of the year because these are so good. I'm gonna keep these. Oh my gosh. These are just so freaking good. Full coverage. They smell delicious and they're just great. So I'm gonna keep the ones I'm keeping on the side here. This Lawless Lipstick in the shade Baby. I know I've had for a while. Used it, what, one time? In the trash it's old wow these huda lipsticks man definitely from last year oh my goodness this is a shade honey bun it's got the indication on the bottom that once it's open it'll last 18 months it's it's definitely we're, we're approaching time Ugh. Oh my gosh, MAC Lip Primer, this is old. This will be part of my back to MAC. Milk Makeup Kush Clear Brow Gel. I use this once or twice. It's been some time. It says that it expires in six months. According to the bottom, this is obviously expired. Fenty Matte Moselle Lipstick in the shade Up to No Good. This is old. This is gonna go in the trash. Wow, even looking at these, I'm like, where have these been? Jeeva's Place, gotta go. Sigma Liquid Lipstick, it's been some time. The Revlon Ultra Matte Lip Color, also old, gotta go. 
These two colors are so cute and I'm annoyed. The Jo Michelle Pearl makeup, this is really old. She sent this to me years ago. Kaveen, or if the, if the V is pronounced with a U, this is old. This is from when I used to get BoxyCharm. Love the color, it's just old. They've gotta go. Artist Couture sent me their first ever PR box over a year ago, or at least a year ago. This is old, this one has to go. This is the shade Boy Toy. Oba Beauty is a Ghanaian black owned brand. This is an old product. I haven't gotten anything from them in a long time. That's gotta go. It's Sigma lip gloss. I don't use it and it's it's definitely knocking on old's door. So these two definitely have to go. This is another one, part of the Dose of Colors Nima Tang set that I purchased. I loved it. It was just so dark on me. Well, I like to see it. It was so, so dark on me and it's old. Beautiful, beautiful packaging, but really old. So has to go. Oh my goodness. I love this lipstick Kinkster. When I do my back to Mac, I'm gonna add this to it. The five items to get a free lipstick. I'm gonna see if they have Kinkster. This is old and this is such a beautiful shade. I'm gonna get this again for sure. Honey, let me tell you, all of these Revlon <laughs> lipsticks, they're all old. I have not used these drugstore items in a minute. All of these great shades, gotta go, they're old. Do you see, do you, do you just see how easy it is to hang on to old stuff? Oh my goodness gracious. Another NYX beautiful shaded lipstick, very old, gotta go. Kike Cosmetics, worked with them a long, well, like a year or over a year ago. These are very old, this has to go. I've got two Kevin Kwan lipsticks, never touched, gonna keep these. Wow, this is looking real empty. <laughs> Now, one of these days I'm gonna come back in here and actually wipe all this down. I just don't feel like it right now. My, 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 another lip drawer and I already am sick to my stomach because again, barely, barely used items. This gloss, for instance, was in a pack, a holiday set from Fenty. This one has to go, oh wow, these glosses have a nine month expiration. So, wow, the, like this dose of colors? The dose of colors one is not that old. So we're gonna keep this one. The glazed lip oil, wow, let's see. When does it expire? It doesn't say. Oh, I'm gonna just try to stretch that one. <laughs> Makeup by Mario Maurice. This, I, what? Wow, have I ever even, I've used this what, one time? Hang on, I need to breathe, okay. NYX have not purchased them in a long time. This is gonna go. These glosses are old. Charlotte Tilbury, Juvia's, anything Juvia's is old because I haven't gotten PR from them in a minute. And I remember this particular PR box. It was absolutely gorgeous. All these shades are phenomenal. Full coverage, just amazing. But every last one of them are at least two years old, if not, a year and a half. I mean, they're very, very old. I hate having to get rid of these. Some of these I've never even used and they probably aren't even sold. This, you see what I mean? Like this is just agonizing. Ooh, I love this color. Too Faced, old, gotta go. Juvia's Place glosses. This was also part of one of the packages, old, gotta go. So is this product. <laughs> this product oh my gosh these two old gotta go wow i feel like i have nothing good thing i keep on getting pr so as i'm trying things out i'm gonna put them in here all of these are from pink lips cosmetics and i believe they're in target now i got these a while ago i mean over a year ago they gotta go and see what I mean with BoxyCharm? I purchased an extra one of these liquid lips because it was so good, I've never used it. So here's where you need to look. When opened, this open box tells you you've got 12 months, but it has not been opened, so I can keep this. This is also Pink Lips Cosmetics, gotta go. Wowzers. Okay, wow. And then in this drawer, I'm about to clear all this out. The, I, I can already see some offenders here, okay? Extremely old. Black Radiance, what in the world? No, gotta go. Matte old. ColourPop blush, have I ever even used this? Maybe once or twice, this is old. Wow, this is from the Lip Bar. This is from last year, this is old. These e.l.f. blushes are my absolute fave, but this is wicked old, gotta go. Lawless blush, old, gotta go. Pat McGrath Labs, this is new, this can stay. This is a Sephora blush, hold on. Oh, this one's new. Tiger Lily, yeah, this can stay. Oh my gosh, this is all good stuff. Morphe, this bronzer is wicked old, gotta go. This Saharan blush palette from JP, gotta go. These are at least two years. Kike blush palette, gotta go. LYS, this is definitely a year or so. Let's see. Oh, okay, this has a two year, what you call it, so I can still keep this. These concealers from JP, gotta go. This Hula Toasted Bronzer, did I ever even use this? I never even used this. Let me give this away. Oh, and this Huda Beauty Stick Cream Blush, this is new, I can keep this. <laughs> There's like nothing in here. Oh, and this Snickeroons, Snackeroons Bead Bakery, this is new, I can keep this. 
Here in this bottom drawer, I've got all of my lashes. I recently restocked up on my lashes. I buy them in bulk from AliExpress because why not? I love the, I wanted to call it a shade. It's not a shade, whatever. I love the D22 style because these are so good. Nice and thick and fluffy. They get my looks all the way together every single time. So I love these and I buy them in bulk. They come maybe in a few weeks. I don't know. I don't buy them when I need them. So when they get here, they get here, you see? So when I'm going down on my stash, I buy them. So love that. I got extra beauty sponges over here. I don't even use all of these. I try to just recycle the ones that I'm already using. I don't like to make a whole bunch of mess and then have to clean it up later, but this is where I stash my sponges. I'll leave it there because that's okay. This brush needs to be cleaned. I have an extra 70 brush from Sephora, which is great because this is for a foundation. I need to clean this. Let me gather the brushes that need to be cleaned. This is one of them. Okay, in this drawer, I have all my mascaras and some extra concealers. The majority, if not all the ones that I've had in here, have been here for a very long time. And these are brand new. And this is what makes me so sick. All right, so for instance, like I said, said before this open cap right here is what tells you when this item will expire so when it's open it will last for six months well this is not open so what i'm going to do because it's just so hard to get through all these mascaras is give some of these away i mean this is obnoxious like this is not in the box so if I give it away, it'll look a little suspect, but I've never used it. I should I should try the ones that don't have a package just so it doesn't look suspect when I give them away. Okay, so I'll keep these here. These don't have a box. Let's see, this is Le Mercier Mascara, Huda Beauty Mascara. I'll give these two away. This is a lip bar mascara. I have tried this in the past, so I can give this one away. See, this is another Too Faced mascara. It just looks raggedy because of where it's been, but I've never used this. Uh, oh, have I? Hold on. <laughs> Yeah, I have. Uh-oh, okay, let's open these up. I cannot. This is old. I don't remember using this, Charlotte Tilbury. This looks new. I'm gonna use this. Kevin Aquant, I've had this for a while. I'm not giving this to anybody. That'd be just tragic. I've had this for too long. This, oh, the Shayla collab. You know this is old. You know this is old. Too old to even think about it, honey. Even this one I feel like is old. Let's see. Never been used. I'm gonna work my way through this one as well. I'll keep that there. What is this? For Hank and Henry? I don't even know what this company is. I'll give that one away. All right, I have another lip bar mascara. I can donate this. These are in the boxes, so this is good. This is new. I've tried the milk makeup mascara and it was just okay. Milani, I have not tried that one. NARS, I got this in the holiday collection. Have not tried this. These are concealers. Oh, this is lash glue. Okay, hang on, I have extra lash glue in here. Another bag gal bang. Look at that. There's a bag gal bang right here, right? What did I say? They're real, magnet. Is that what this is? Wait. I thought I saw a bad gal bang. I don't know. Another one in this box right here. Listen. Whoa. Let's keep this. This is a nice palette to apply makeup on and apply products on before applying to the face. I always use my hand. I don't use this. So this can go away, I guess. I'm gonna clean that off and give it away. Lash glue. That's always a must. Goof Poof Brow Pencil from Benefit. This one I can give away. Oh, I have some lip primers from MAC. I did not realize I had these here. MAC Prep and Prime Lips. Interesting. Okay, I'm gonna use those. Hold on. Because you know one thing about me is I'm gonna stock it up, okay? Morphe concealers. I remember stocking up on these too. But the full coverage concealers, this is the shade C4.35. I like this shade a lot. Wow, I have one, two, three, four. They must have had a sale. Five, what? Six. I have so many and this is another MAC Prep and Prime Lip. What? Let's clean this. All right, let's organize these concealers. Urban Decay Primer Potion. I already have one of these. I'm gonna give that away. I'm gonna give away this Duo Mascara because someone's gonna be able to use it before I get to it. I've already used this Maybelline Mascara several times actually, so. Not that one in particular, but another one because I've had several iterations of it. And then we have this Kiss Lash Adhesive. I'm gonna keep this because I love a good lash glue. Believe it or not, I still have this ColourPop and Shayla lipstick. I cannot believe it. This is one of those lipsticks that have been so hard for me to even get through and get rid of because when she had this collab with ColourPop and I got this shade Ooh, it is the most gorgeous, amazing, peachy, nudie, fantastic lipstick for brown skin. I will never get over this. So I bought so many of them and I've 
making my way through them, here's a brand new one that has never been used. I will not lie to you. I'm not gonna get rid of this because it's so good. And then when I wear it, I can't tell what it is because you're not gonna find it. But this is one of those good ones that just, you just have to hold on to, okay? I remember this color switch. Remember this thing? It is so dirty. I would use it while doing makeup to clean off a brush really quickly. And it does work. It's just, let me show you. Who recalls this? I would just do this and then clean off the color from the brush. I mean, this is stained and this is old, but anyway, this is old. I'm gonna get rid of it. All right, got some eyeliner, straight out of patience. I have so many eyeliners. Let me just give that away. I mean, I am drowning in eyeliners, honey. What is this? Pacifica Star Glaze Length. Oh, it's a mascara. Okay, another mascara. Look at this. Oh, I stocked up on my favorite Lawless One and Done mascaras. This must've been during one of the sales. I don't know, but honey, we gonna keep these because this is a fave of mine. You kidding me? Lawless One and Done for the bottom mascara. Mm, love it. Put them right here. I'm gonna put this one in the bathroom because I do need one over there. Eyeliner, the Revlon Mag The Stallion. Okay, brown eyeliner. Extra lip primer from LA Girl. I bought this to try out because the e.l.f. one is discontinued. I don't like it. I'm gonna give it away. That's a new one. This is a Kosas Big Clean Mascara. Never used. I should give it a try. It's open. It's weird to give things like this away without a box. So I'll try that. Oh man, one size eyeliners. I'm sure these are really good. Let's see. Ooh, it's giving used, although I don't remember using it, but it just looks used. So I don't wanna give it away and scare anybody. What is this? Ooh, Westman Atelier brow pencil in the color Slate. Why does this look? Is this gray? I'm gonna give this away. Mm -mm. Ooh, got this vinyl eyeliner. It's looking a little bit gray. Nice color. I'll give this away. It's brand new. Oh my gosh, I know that these are old. The LA Girl Shock, but this is brand new. The wrapping is still on it. These are so pretty. I'm gonna keep these because they're really pretty. I like them. I used to be all over them and it's just been a while. What is this? Oh, another, oh, okay, one size eyeliner. I love these cream eyeliners for the waterline and the top line. It's just, it goes on very easy. What is this? We're not, no, coal eyeliners, not gonna work anymore. What is this? This is a brand new Revlon micro gel eyeliner. This is good for the waterline because of the shade. I'll give it away. It's been a while since I've put a light color like that in my waterline. Ooh, a brown eyeliner. Need this. What is this? Another black. We always need a good black eyeliner around here, okay? Sharp line. I'll be doing wings and stuff. Let's give this away. This is a blue eyeliner. It's brand new. I'll give this away. Revlon Color Stay Brow Pencil. It's thick, so I'll give that away. This is a brand new LA Girl situation. And then this is a Charlotte Tilbury. I'll give this away. All right, let's clean this. Alrighty. Now in this drawer, it's just, there's just so much chocolate in here. This is my foundation drawer, my goodness. This is not everything that I've had, but this is everything that I've had recently. Man, this is gonna be so hard for me because I really don't wanna have 17,000 foundations, but there are some good ones in here. Last summer, this was a banger. The NARS, what was this? Light reflectant situation. I loved this. Fenty Pro Filter in the shade 490, that has to go. I mean, that's not my shade. I have found that 485 is perfect and it's still dark, but it's perfect for me. Watch the video where I used it. I don't need 490, but you know, the ones that I'm not gonna keep, I do wanna give to someone because some of these are not terribly old, you feel what I'm saying? So I'm gonna I'm put aside and give to someone that I know. I did try this Revlon Longwear Makeup Foundation. I did enjoy this. I'm gonna keep it. Fenty, let's see, 23 was a little bit dark. This is this blurring skin tint. This was nice. I'm gonna keep this. Oh my gosh, I'm keeping so many already. House Labs, what did I feel about it? Listen, it's even hard to remember how I felt about stuff. Like what? I think I enjoyed this, didn't I? <laughs> did you? Comment and let me know. I have so many Fenty's, it's out of this world. 470, gotta go. I was trying to figure out my shade and I don't know sometimes I get sent them as well 450 this has to be old because I have not worn 450 in god knows how long I know by the shades what is really really old oh my gosh I have not worn a Morphe foundation in ages filter deep 335 mm -mm. I just know that's old what is this Giorgio Armani luminous silk Ooh, I liked this but if I remember correctly it was a little red 13.5 ah giveaway you know how much I love this makeup forever foundation there's no way I'm giving this one away what so good another Fenty how many Fenty's do we have? Count below and let me know. 460. Again, I was trying to search. Mm -mm. After it's open, you have a year to use it. I think that this 460 is not terribly old. Give that away. Oh my gosh. The Dior Forever Foundation. I did enjoy this. Nice and dark. The color is very dark. I'm going to keep this. That's not that old. This Rose Ink Skin Tint. I used once or twice. I'm gonna give this away. Another NARS Light Reflecting. I'm gonna give this away because I remember that I liked the darker shade of it. Too Faced Born This Way. This looks light on me. This is the shade Cocoa. I'm gonna give that away. 
Oh man, Makeup Forever Ultra HD. I like this too. This is the shade Y545, but I more so enjoy the HD skin. So I'm gonna give that one away. And I've had this one for a while, the Lip Bar Skin Tint. It is really good, but it's been a while. Dior Backstage, I wore this out of last year actually for a concert and I was in a wear test. And oh my God, you're supposed to get rid of that the 12 months. They get on my nerves. Like I only use this like once. I'm gonna I'm gonna try to get some use out of this. I'm not giving that away quite yet okay so for our micro smooth why is there a powder in here i have a different drawer for powders but we're here now micro smooth powder in the shade deep this is not that old i'm gonna give this away i like this iconic london super smooth blurring skin tint this is old then i throw that away oh rare beauty did i ever wear this tinted moisturizer in the shade 56 n i know i wore this didn't i what did i think about it i don't even remember let me hang on to it because i honestly cannot remember wow Sephora Best Skin Ever, this is 59N. I did enjoy this, but I always got confused on which shade was actually mine. I've got 59N, 59N, 63P, so many colors. Ease Drop 22. This is my shade more so for the winter time, not for the summer. So I'm gonna give this one away. And then these, these two look light and I think I'm gonna keep the P. I'm gonna try this one more time. I enjoyed this Zoeva foundation. I remember it was hydrating, wasn't it? Yeah, naturally luminous. This is good. Drugstore, you want me luminous? This is really good. I'm gonna give this away. Oh my gosh, NARS Soft Matte. Hello, Iguasu Deep 3. I enjoyed this. So I'm gonna key, hold on. I think this one is gonna be cool. Oh, this gives you two years. Love that. Okay, so this is still good. I'm gonna keep that. I have another NARS Soft Matte. I have another HD skin in my shade. So. So I'm gonna keep all of these. Yes, ma'am. This is another deep three. I have two of these. Hold on. Oh my gosh. These were all the rave too. Remember these? The NYX Total Control Drops. These are old. I liked these a lot. It felt just like a serum on the skin. Literally just like putting on a serum, like a liquid. And the pigmentation is so high. Not every foundation has to be thick in order for it to cover you. I mean, it just was like a serum and it just covers so well. I can't stand it. I haven't used this in so long. I feel like these are mad old, but I like them. I need to repurchase this. I'm annoyed. I'm gonna repurchase for sure. The NYX Can't Stop Won't Stop Foundation has always been a favorite of mine. This is Deep Cool. What? This is old because I have not used this in so long. I'm definitely gonna repurchase this because it is that stinking good. Drugstore 2, absolutely love this. This Beauty Blender Foundation, I remember I liked it, I think. This is the issue with having stuff for a long time. I did a video on it and I think I liked it, but it's definitely been a year. Let's take a look at the expiration on the back. Once it's open it expires in 12 months so this is definitely expired this has to go i know for sure that this is old like there's just no need but i love this so much deep bronze number 370 from maybelline god this is so stinking good full coverage amazing i'm gonna buy this again because this is really good i don't know what this lys concealer is doing here but i've definitely had this for a year and i got some new ones in that i'm gonna try out again with a full face of, of lys so i'm gonna actually toss this one it's old i know that these are old it's been laying down hence why you see that this is separated oh how do you even mix it it should have been standing up but even if it was standing up i feel like it would still separate i don't know i've had this for some time it expires one month after opening i'm gonna get rid of this too these were good though i did a video on them i think they were very hydrating and dewy let me know below in the comments if you use this and if you liked it but i recall all these were good the it cosmetics cc nude glow i did a campaign with this and i enjoyed it it was glowy for sure the color was very nice but it's been a while this is old. It expires 12 months after opening. Did a video on this Lawless foundation. I remember being very red. I did make it work, but it was red and it expires 12 months after opening. So this has to go as well. I don't think I ever used this. I don't think I ever used this. So let me open it to confirm. Oh no, wait, I did use this, but when? Okay, I used this, jeez. I don't remember using this. Deep 2 and 90 N and it expires one year after opening. This is old, so I gotta get rid of it. Here's another Charlotte Tilbury, gonna get rid of this too. Oh my gosh, this is so old. It's perfect for makeup artists because you can mix and match and make your own colors out of it. This is old. I used this for Holly makeup three Halloweens ago, mad old. But this is so good because you can use this to make lipstick, blush, foundation, you name it, because you're just doing color theory to mix things together. This is definitely for professionals. It's not something for an everyday person to buy and to use. A brand new Makeup Forever HD 4N74. What? <laughs> Love, that's gonna stay. This Giorgio Armani foundation, I never used it. This is number 13. Are we even still using this? Let me open this up. I remember using this in a video, but this shade, obviously I have not used. It looks very light. I'm gonna give this away. Ooh, 
Ooh, I remember this one. I used it in a campaign and I enjoyed this. It was a nice shade on me. It's really old. It's been over a year. This is so good. This has to go to. Wow, if you see a MAC foundation, you know this thing is ancient. Excuse me? I have not purchased a MAC foundation in ages. What? This should be a crime and there's nothing written on it. This has to be NW50 maybe? It's not 45, 45 is a lot lighter. Wow, this is old. Oh my goodness. Ah, uh, who still has their MAC foundation? You gotta comment, let me know. Maybelline Tinted Moisturize. I did a video on this. I remember this really, really vividly. This is old, expires 12 months after opening. This has to go. We got a Kevin Aquan Skin Tint, never used. I'm gonna give this away. Oh my God, Estee Lauder. <laughs> Double wear, I love this foundation. This one's never been opened at 8N1. I'm definitely gonna keep this because I love this foundation, excuse me. And then we have the Huda Beauty Stick Foundation. I use this shade Ganache as a contour. This is old though. This one expires one year after opening. This is such a great contour. I gotta make room for some new ones and this is old. I gotta get rid of this. Definitely need to clean this up. Now this is the drawer with all of my powders. Oh my goodness, way too many. I know that there are so many in here that are so old and it just pains me to have to even get rid of them. I love these Fenty Beauty powder foundations. This one is 450. Can you believe that I used to use 450 on my face? Just insane. I know that this one's old, it has to go. Here's 390, this is barely used, but this is also old. And again, as a reminder, it expires 12 months after opening, so this has to go. This one's brand new from Sephora. I'm gonna keep this, thank goodness, because I love that one a lot. This Laura Mercier powder is not that old. It does have a 12 month expiration date, but it has not been 12 months yet. This is fairly new. This Urban Decay Translucent Powder is old and I feel like it's discontinued. I'm gonna let this one go since I already have another one that's fresh. Sephora Matte Powder Foundation. I use it only a few times. This is one of my tried and true favorites. This one size, Dark 4G. This one's old, I have another one, so I'm gonna get rid of this one. Oh my gosh, it's another Glow Wish by Huda Beauty. I used to use this shade on my face, but I prefer this product on my under eye area instead, so I'm gonna get rid of this one. This is the shade 11 Deep. Becca, I just know this is old. I haven't used this in God knows how long. Prime Beauty, this was sent to me. I think this is a black owned brand, I'm not sure. This is also old. I remember loving this Say powder. It's also luminous, radiant, loose, setting powder. Oh. Seeing this reminds me that I love it. I got time, we're gonna keep this one. So many powders, ooh, this is old. Urban Decay, this is wicked old. Oh yeah, these e.l.f. matte setting powders, old. Makeup Forever, this is old, this expires 12 months. Oh my gosh, all these CoverGirl ones expired. I used to love these powders. Drugstore, great coverage, gotta go. NYX Can't Stop, Won't Stop powder, I don't even think I use. Wow, I use this once or twice. It's old, so it has to go. Oh my gosh, Huda Beauty Banana Bread. This is old, it has to go. NYX Can't Stop, Won't Stop Powder, old. The Lip Bar, this is old. Oh my gosh, MAC Studio Fix. Oh my gosh, this has to go. NW45, first of all, not my color, but second of all, extremely old. This was the KBD Vegan Beauty Foundation for my face. This is 88. Oh my God, it expires one year. That means that it's already expired, <laughs> but I like this. Let's hang on a second. This is a foundation, it's not a powder. Okay, we want just <laughs> pretend that we didn't see that. Okay, hi. Oh my gosh, this Aether Beauty highlight. First of all, I have random things in here. This is a highlighter, it shouldn't be here, but this is very old. This has to go. Huda Beauty Cinnamon Bun. I know this one is old. I feel like they sent me some new ones, so this has to go. We clearly liked this one. This has to go from Fenty. Another Laura Mercier Translucent Honey. Ooh one year, I feel like this is old. CoverGirl, gotta go, very old. I know this Urban Decay one is old. Fenty Pro Filter 450, not even my shade, old. This one I know is old. Tatcha the Silk Powder, oh my gosh, old, so good. CoverGirl, old and really good. Elf Powder, this is old too, gotta go. Oh my God, this is a brand new Becca. This has to go. Givenchy Prisma Libre, this is new. I'm gonna keep this. I'm actually gonna give this one away. I know this one is old. This Fenty Banana, oh my gosh, it smells so good. Wow, way back in the cup, Black Opal Beauty Oil Absorbing Powder. Love, love, love this, extremely old. These Kosas powders I've had for a while. You know I still use Kosas, but I think it's gotta be old. Oh, two years. Ooh, this one was for the face. This is the shade Dreamy. Oh my gosh, Charlotte Tilbury, what? Look at this, I may have used it one time. Two years, okay, I'm gonna use this again, cause what? This is expensive and beautiful. Mario, what, bronzing powder? I don't like the color of it, this is gonna go. Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk F Fusion Powder. I've never used this, have I? Ooh, I don't think I've ever used this. This is Bare Minerals Bare Pro. I, mm, have I used this? Deep 
55 neutral. I'm gonna use this. I'm gonna give it away. And I used to be in love with this Ciate London powder. It is really, really good. It's just old. I'll get rid of this one too. Oh. oh Lord, we have setting sprays. There are a lot in here that just have to go. Primers, these are primers. This milk makeup I know is new, that can stay. Why is there a liquid highlighter in here? Ooh, the glow screen can stay. YSL Glow In Balm, this is old, this can go. Professional by Benefit, this, this is old, this can go. Ooh, all nighters, oh my gosh. Let me keep one of them and give one of them away. This is old. Who remembers Scandinavia? Oh my goodness, back when I was a makeup artist. You can tell I have never done this because I had these when I was an artist. We got post makeup recovery, oil control, and bridal. All of this is extremely old. They worked so well though, so well. This is not that old, but it's old enough. So I'm gonna get rid of this Morphe spray. This NYX can't stop, won't stop, gotta go. Oh my gosh, brand new. Iconic London Prep Set and Glow. I'm gonna give this away. Ciate London Dewy Coconut Mist. I've never opened this. I'm gonna hold on to it. Kevin Aquan Sensual Skin Primer. Have I ever used this? Have I ever even used this? Oh my gosh. I've used this milk makeup one. Oh my gosh, I got a Fenty primer. This is the Fenty Mattifying Primer. I'm gonna hold on to that. This Ben Nye Final Seal is old. Oh, this is the LYS dupe to the Milk Makeup Hydro Grip Secure Skin Gripping Serum Primer. Hmm, should I try this for the winter? time maybe mac what this is extremely old haven't used this in ages this i got maybe less than a year ago i'll give this away Giorgio armani luminous silk hydrating primer i'll give this away ben my final seal i took some down to use look at the color oh my god so old this dewy stick from ciate gotta go oh i have not used this one glow nourishing body glow this is a body glow from ciate never used oh this is old tula Wow, my stash is dwindling down, honey. Okay, there's that. What's in here? Oh, nails. I'm so annoyed. <laughs> okay, we're gonna leave this nail stash. Oh my goodness, eyeshadow palettes. Essentially everything in here has to go. That is so hard for me to have to do because some of these are so lightly used that it's insane. Used one time maybe, but They've gotta go, 12 month expiration dates and such. This is so insane. Oh my gosh, Natasha Zanona. 24 months, okay, not everything gotta go. This one's gonna stay. Revolution gotta go. Oh, this Jaclyn Hill Divine Neutrals. I really love these shades. This Wet n Wild palette I did a video on, that has to go. Man, all these Juvia's Place palettes. This is Zodiac Spectrum. What was this? Have I ever used this? Oh my gosh. This one has to go. Sigma, I used to use this a lot. That has to go. Too Faced, you know I love me some Topaz Obsessions. That has to go. Ooh, Milani. I did a video on this last summer, I think it was. I always love these shades right here. So brown girl friendly. This Lawless one, aw, this was a tribute to her daughter, I believe it was. So cute, I love this, that has to go. All the JP ones gotta go. They're just all so old, expired. This Milani one, I did a drugstore video. Mm, a year ago. So these all have to go. Ace Boutte, Boutte. This was from BoxyCharm. Oh my gosh, nostalgic. Look at that. Cinema Secrets brush cleaner spilled in here years ago. Juvia's Place, Juvia's Place. Oh, BFF, Alondra and Elsie. This, when, when did I get this? I, I used this one time right here. This is extremely old. Artistry Studio, this is old. This is Tom Ford. I got this a year ago. I know that this is expired. And the colors are too cool too for my skin tone. Tarte Brown Palette. Ooh, look at these shades. Oh, two years. This can stay. Wow, so from this, I'm left with two eyeshadow palettes. Can you believe that? That is insane. I mean, I have one or two in my stash in the bathroom, but that's it. That's wild. But it also goes to show that I have not been purchasing eyeshadow palettes either. I forgot that I have more eyeshadow palettes. This is painful, okay? These all came in a set. These Huda, so I'ma keep it. This is giving two years. Oh my gosh, I did a video on this Urban Decay Ultraviolet palette. 
I love that JP gotta go. Oh, Beauty Marked & Co, Ganyan brand. Oh, this is old. Too Faced Let's Play, this is old. Ooh, the Rose Quartz, did I use this? I only used it one time. Such a beautiful palette. It gives, it's got a two year lifespan. <laughs> Hold on. This I've never used, ever. 24 months, this can stay. Too Faced, that's my jam, that's old. Oh, the Fenty, the ones that click, click together. Mmm. Old. Okay, Urban Decay Wild Wild West. This is old. I guess I can keep the ultraviolet because this was, I think, last year. So I got two years on this. JP, Wahala. Oh man, when that came out, this is, I've never used this. Purple Rain. This is old, baby. Too Faced Pumpkin. I love this one because of the colors. This is 12 months. It's old. Ace Boutte. Old, gotta go. This Urban Decay Cherry. I'm not gonna use these. This is giving two years. Uh, let's see, Juvia's Place. Oh, gotta go, gotta go. Jaclyn Hill Volume 2. I loved this palette, gotta go. Oh my gosh, this JP one I feel like is brand new. Okay, I did use it, it is old. These are all so old. What a lot of JPs. I liked this one, what is this? Hip Dot, this is old. Oh, Violet Voss. Are they still around? That's so good. Oh, this is the first Jaclyn Hill palette. I liked it. Oh, bah. Mm -hmm. This is also old. Wow. There we go. It's done. <laughs> Woo! Okay, now we are done. I feel so much better. If you've already been seeing my vlogs, you know that I have been on a mission to purge and just get stuff out of here. I don't like holding on to stuff for no good reason. Yes, I donated the gently used items and yes, I threw away the old stuff, okay? I'm not trying to get no styes and just random things like that. It's just not even necessary. Thankfully, I'm either buying new makeup that comes out or I'm getting a lot of things in PR. So it'll always get replenished. And with that being said, I've got giveaway boxes that I wanna give away. So since you finished watching this video, I'm gonna choose folks randomly from the comment section. If there's no specific word or code for this video, video. Just comment like you randomly would and I'll choose a few winners that way. Thanks for watching the video and I'll see you in the next one.